need for iot system management as we know that iot system in iot system may a lot of devices sensors uh, actuators are connected each other so that it have uh, a complex software hardware uh, including sensor actuator extra and network resources data collection analysis and communication protocol user interface that's why we need to manage all of the, the devices what are the needs to uh, manage these devices are we are uh, seeing here uh, what are the needs to manage these devices these are first of all is automating configuration what is automatic configuration in automating configuration when a system consists of multiple devices or nodes we have to automate these uh, devices uh, mul uh, multiple nodes uh, smi system interface uh, system management interface provide uh, predicate and easy to use management capability to automate the system configuration manual configuration are avoided uh, why we avoid to manual configuration and why are to, uh, we configure our system automatically to ensure all devices have the same configuration and variation the next thing monitoring operational and statistical data what is operational data operational data the system operating parameter are collected by the system at runtime in case our iot system the data will be collected through the sensors and actuators the data is collected in at runtime is our operational data and the data after operation performs the performance of cpu uh, is called our statistical data this data uh, will be in the form of fault diagnosis from the system or some forecasting uh, that system uh, will uh, us have this uh, have for us the third thing is improved uh, reliability improved uh, reliability the reliability of the system could be improved by validating the system configuration before use when uh, we have to use the system uh, we have uh, to configure system that uh, we ensure that our system is uh, more reliable the next thing system wide configuration uh, what is system wide configuration in system wide configuration integration the iot system consists of multiple devices or nodes which have to uh, which have wide system configuration for uh, correct functioning each device is configured configured separately we have two method to configure our devices the first is manual and the other is automated we have to configure our devices even either uh, manually or uh, automatically the next thing multiple system configuration system some system have multiple valid configuration according to the different time or in certain condition uh, the system is capable to uh, configure itself automatically uh, according to the situation according to the uh, some uh, special circumstances uh, so their system had a valid multiple configuration the last thing is retrieving and uh, reusing configuration help in reuse the configuration for other devices for the same type uh, ensure that the when the new device is added the same configuration is applied the management system can retrieve the current configuration from our device and apply the same to the new device